the only solution is to just make something more permanent. Luke Richter, president of the Central Oregon Peacekeepers, says last week he found a poster filled with heartfelt handwritten messages at the Barry Washington Jr. Memorial in downtown Bend ripped in half. Some people just have immediately made it political and they don't like that. On September 30th, Ian Cranston was arraigned on second degree murder charges in the shooting death of Barry Washington Jr. There is no charge of a bias crime, though an investigation is still ongoing. It feels like the second something BIPOC gets, puts up, gets put up, it gets messed with. Richter says he has spoken with Barry's mother, who would like a plaque and permanent memorial, as well as renaming the intersection of Wall Street and Oregon Avenue, Barry's Corner. I spoke with Ben Mayor Sally Russell on the phone, who says the city is still exploring the idea of a more permanent memorial and has not had any definitive discussions. The city says there's no formal process to establish a permanent memorial downtown. Any consideration would need to account for right-of-way codes and permits. Richter and the Peacekeepers also want to include the name of Deshaun Adderley, a 14-year-old who died by suicide in 2017. In 2020, there was a petition to put a plaque at some high to honor Deshaun. At that time, Carol Palmer, a mental health counselor with Central Oregon's chapter of the Compassionate Friends, told News Channel 21, We definitely do not want to do anything that would, in any way, glorify or glamorize suicide. Certainly, if it's specified that he died by suicide, that would be the worst thing that I would want to see on that plaque. Richter says Deshaun dealt with bullying and racial harassment and wants his name acknowledged. Whatever his family's comfortable with, just something that's going to just let people know that he existed. But he says above all, he wants a permanent reminder of what happened to Barry Washington Jr. This is a situation that we've all been told it doesn't happen in Bend. And it happened in Bend, and now we need to make sure that it doesn't happen in Bend again. Yeah, I'm back here live downtown, and I'm told that there's actually two photos of Barry Washington that were above this poster that have since disappeared. It's unclear whether they just fell off in the wind or if someone took them down, but I'm told that's the exact reason why the community wants a permanent memorial here. Live in downtown Bend, Noah Chast, News Channel 21.